Okay, guys, so we're currently trolling Smurf right now. And I don't know if he notices me. I'm trying to shoot arrows at him without him noticing. Oh my god, let's see if he's looking at us. Alright, he's not. Let's go, let's go. Boom. Oh, come on. Did, did he notice? <laughs> he's just not looking around like, what the heck just happened? <laughs> hey, guys, what is up? This is Pirate Gaming here, and welcome back to another rating episode on Psycho PvP. So, in today's episode, we have a little something special. We have a double raid for you guys. So, in the double raid, I mean, the raids were pretty decent, and considering that it is the, like, I don't know, it's in, like, in this first week of the reset, I'd say the raids were actually pretty decent. The first raid was actually really good. Like, there was actually spawner, and then there were some diamonds and loots in there. And then the second raid was just a plain old cactus farm, but there were some loots, and there was also a hopper there. Uh, but you had the creeper egg to get, and I didn't want to waste the creeper egg to get one single hopper because I already have like a stack and something. So yeah, I hope you guys do enjoy this double raid, and yeah, let's get into the double raid video. Hey guys, what is up? This is Pirate Gaming here, and welcome back to another raiding episode here on Psycho PvP. So today I was here, well, well, I was here raiding this base with Gunchy, Morgan, and. I think the other guy was like line PvP or crazy line PvP. I'm assuming that was it. I'm not sh really sure. Oh yeah, it was crazy line PvP. So shout out to these two guys for teeping me to this raid. So by this raid, all we had to do was like cannon the the um the fences and then cannon the cobble wall. But unfortunately, on the other side there was a um there is another like um cobble wall and it was also protected with water which really sucks so that means we had to go from the other side and from the other side it, it was like all unprotected which is pretty amazing so we went from the other side and then we discovered the part where it wasn't like protected at all which is really awesome so we got to like raid that part of it and so we basically didn't have to do much except I only used a couple of creeper eggs, which I didn't mind, but we went from the other side and we used some um, TNT to blow up, to blow our way into the base, which, oh my god, it was actually pretty rich. It was a chicken spawner, and it is the beginning of the reset, so it is pretty good to get like any spawner you can get a hold of, and so yeah, that was actually really useful. And I also got a di I also got a bunch of diamonds, which can be sold for a lot. And then you can buy another spawner with those diamonds that you sold. Because I'm pretty sure on Tiger PvP that 16 diamonds sell for like a thousand two hundred. I'm pretty sure that's the amount at Warp Shop. I'm just guessing. I'm not sure. And so yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it. I'm pretty sure that is the number. So yeah, I'm probably gonna skip this part or just like fast forward it a bit, and then like. Um, all you have to do is, well, I'm just going to skip it, um, fast forward it a little, and then catch you up to the part where um, I actually get into the base, which is the exciting part where we got to loot all the stuffs, and I really enjoyed it, and it was actually really fun, and really a sufficient and efficient way to raid. You have to try from all sides, so you can, like, um, see if there's, like, any unprotected sides, because I'm pretty sure... The opposite side was like not protected at all, which led to their base getting raided. So too bad for them. They didn't protect one side of their base, and we easily got in by like mining to the other side of the base, and then TNTing the walls, and then easily like breaching their base, which is really good. So we got into their base and we raided it. And then the second raid was basically a cactus farm that I raided with a bunch of people who I had no idea who were, who they were because I don't really see them much. And yeah, they were like new people to me. Like I had no idea who they were. And they, I think they were in like another faction. I think it was pretty popular actually. And yeah, I think it has like 30 people actually, which is a really large number. But I'm not familiar with their faction name, or like, I think they're a new faction on this reset. I'm really not sure, but that was the Cactus Farm raid, which is the raid after this one. And that is why I'm making a double raid, because the Cactus Farm one wasn't really worth uploading. And it was pretty short, so I just decided to upload it. Um, upload it including with this one to make it a little longer and a little more exciting. So I hope you guys don't mind that, and I hope you guys do enjoy the rest of the video, as I'm going to fast forward it and add some music to it, to make it a little more swaggy, yeah. Okay guys, so I'll catch you guys up in the next episode. 